committees, uh, select committees provide a really vital function. Um, and I, it's around uh, checks and balances and accountability and actually scrutinizing and understanding an actual evidence base. Um, and I go back to um, uh, Ian's friend who tweeted earlier around evidence, evidence, evidence. Um, obviously political decisions, um, as much as we would like them to be completely evidence-based and are seen through a slightly a different skewed lens, whereas uh, a committee's job is to be completely independent and to scrutinise the evidence in a, in a completely independent way. And I think I sometimes fear that along with a wider sort of undermining of institutions and experts, um, etc., then we end up sort of not paying as much heed to what these are, which are really vital functions, again, of our democracy, to make sure that they are, that the government pays attention to them, that they're respected and that they're adhered to, and that the evidence base, first and foremost, is king here, um, and should be at the complete forefront of everything that we're, that we're talking about. Um, I mean, we, this, this applies across all of the areas that we're talking about, you know, if only it was a, a very, sort of open evidence-based sort of policy making system that we had then lots of these debates that we were having would be completely redundant um, but unfortunately that's not the case but the role of the, the committee is to ensure that recommendations are made based on the evidence. <laughs>